Okay, so here we've got our part. We're going to go back to the sketch mode. Uh, we're going to do normal. Okay, and let's say we want to uh, locate a particular uh, place on the part and extrude a feature uh, a particular distance or measurement. Okay, so let's look at the top. Okay, and what we're going to do is we're going to draw uh, uh, a line, but we didn't say where. Okay, common mistake. All right, so let's say we're going to draw it on that surface. Uh, this surface here, we're going to draw a line. Uh, now you'll notice we have some options here for construction. Let's draw this for construction and we're going to say we want to do a hole in the center but then we want it three inches from the end. Okay. We're going to right click. We're going to go Smart Dimension. We're going to click this and we're going to say 3.0 inches. So now then we have a point here uh, that's three inches and it's the very center because this snapped at the center line there. So now then let's do a circle on the center. We're going to grab right here circle and we're going to do the uh, smart dimension on that circle and let's say oh, 1.25 inches. All right, that's what it is. Now then, what we want to do after having done that, okay, we've established we've gone to a particular location by use of a construction line, and now then we're going to do the features. We're going to highlight that particular uh, plane. We're going to do extrude cut the parameters over here were already set at blind and the particular direction and so you can see that's already gone through we're going to hit our check mark and the trimetric view and now then we uh oh it doesn't go all the way through it only goes uh, part the way through well let's go back and uh, see if we can solve that little dilemma Okay, now you'll notice when we looked at this from that direction, it didn't go all the way down to the bottom. This is actually an inch and a half. So what we're going to do is we're going to left click on that, and then the pop-up comes up, and then look here, we can edit this feature. We click on that, and the problem here is uh, one and a half inches, okay, or we could put through all, now then we're going to click on that and let's see if we got our problem solved yep see it goes all the way through we could have just as easily have specified a particular length on that so let's try this one more time we've got this right here let's see features that's nothing there to so extrude 5 we're going to edit that feature, okay? And instead of doing, see, blind, let's say we wanted this to be two and a half inches. That's what we do there. We click the check mark, it's done. And, and you see how the, the depth here changes to two and a half inches. And that's it for this one.